That's right, guys. Uh, our Friday Night Live Game of the Week features the North High Stars hosting the South Rebels. Now, it's North High's 60th school anniversary tonight, their homecoming. Time for another chapter in that story, North-South rivalry. The two teams started a Rivalry Week dinner last year. We attended the dinner this year to talk to some ex-coaches and players and find out what makes North versus South more than just a rivalry. Awesome. North. Go. Versus good. South. Good. Go. Good. At the heart of the North South rivalry is a tradition, a trophy to the victor currently held by the South Rebels. The swords mean a lot to every school. When I was going to high school between 79 and 82 at North, we won the swords twice, we lost the swords twice. And we'd have rallies, and the swords were the center of it. And, and that's what makes the game special because there's something that something at stake that gets displayed the rest of the year. But a rivalry with already so much tradition has established a new ritual, a dinner hosted by the home team. It was began by the late South head coach John Wren to honor the storied rivalry so close to his heart. This year's game and dinner are in the honor of Coach Wren, a man close to the hearts of both teams, opposite sides of the same community. Me and Coach Wren actually had a good connection. I, I talked to him um, at that dinner and since then we actually became close friends and he'd help me out and if I needed something I know he was there for me and more than a friend. He was, he was a coach that I can look towards too and he was a great man. I had the good fortune of coaching him when I was at South High years ago and um, he was also an assistant coach for me when I was the head coach at South High. My wife went to the prom with uh, uh, Coach Wren. That was her first prom date and so I, I knew John for years and years. There's been a push especially with Coach Wren to highlight this game and make it important. The rivalry was important to Coach Wren and while North and South remember Coach Wren tonight, they know there's no better way to honor his memory than to hold nothing back in pursuit of the swords. On his uh wall in his weight room he had a countdown clock right under where the swords would go. 50 days, 5 hours, 10 minutes before we go for the swords again. And that countdown is just to over an hour by now. The two teams will have a ceremonial handshake right before the game. Both the team, the entirety of both North and South will come out. Normally it's just the captains, uh, following which will be for sure a showdown to remember. Join us back here at 1117 for Friday Night Live. We'll have highlights of the game, an interview with head coach Chad Brown, and we'll whip around Kern County for some other scores. It's Friday Night Live at 1117. For now, we're live at North High. Casey Kiernan, 23ABC. See you.